Hello, and welcome to another episode of Tableau in Two Minutes. Today, what we're going to be looking at is how to create a map graph, uh, particularly a, uh, a useful map graph. A lot of data can be mapped or put on a map and looked at geographically, but unless there's some geographic pattern to the data, that's not always particularly uh, helpful. What we have today, though, is we have some data on uh, earthquake times, places, um, dates, and magnitudes. And we're going to go ahead and put that on a graph. So the uh, first thing that you'll see is we have a longitude and latitude field in our data. Uh, those are not necessary for putting on a graph. Tableau will generate those if you have an address or something like that. Uh, but they are very, very helpful if you can, uh, if you can get them. Um, sometimes Tableau does not generate the correct longitude and latitude. So the first thing to do is to drag those up. Uh, we're going to drag longitude up to the column shelf. I'm going to drag latitude to the rows shelf, um, and then it's going to give us this single dot, which is um, right in the middle of the world there on a the map. Uh, next, we're going to take ID. ID uh, denotes every single earthquake, and we're going to drag that to the marks card. That's going to create a mark for every earthquake, and you can see here um, that we have all of the earthquakes mapped out around the world. Now, there is obviously a distinct pattern to those. Uh, they tend to cluster along the, uh, the west coast of the Americas, up around the edge of the Pacific Rim, um, just like earthquake or I mean obviously they are earthquakes and so in this case seeing that pattern is actually very helpful we can tell that there are certain places more likely to have earthquakes than others if we wanted to add a little more detail to this um, we could add depth to the size chart here that's going to tell us how deep it was um, the deeper the earthquake the less severe it is so one of the things we might want to do is just consider um, reversing the scale uh, for some of that uh, we can also add the magnitude to the color here. Um, in this case, again, we're just going to edit the colors to give us this red, blue diverging. And then obviously we want bigger ones are more serious. So we want those to be more red. So we're going to go ahead and check reversed here. That's going to give us this uh, 9.6 as the top of the red. And you can see that there's a handful of uh, little red dots in there and a little bit of color showing us uh, basically the more blue, the less severe, the more red, the more severe. Um, and then actually the smaller the dot, the closer to the surface. So the big dots are the quite deep earthquakes. Uh, we can try and change that here by double clicking and then putting a negative in front of the sum of depth. Um, that way, deeper ones are smaller. Those closer to the surface tend to be, uh, tend to be bigger dots. And that's how to build a useful map graph in Tableau. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. A link to the data is in the video description. Um, and please subscribe to our channel for more Tableau tips and tricks. Thank you very much. We shall see you next time.